guys welcome back so today what we're going to be working on is that market area we're going to try to get them to work on that i do want to just double check to see if there's any other tasks going on right now i think some people are cooking let's see here we got cooking cutting prepping food uh some people are sleeping construction prepping food so yeah a lot of people are um uh constructing and working on that now for our research uh we do have a couple people researching by the looks of it at least one um oh well, maybe two two people now we're just about finished our research uh for all this so we could finish this whole research tree right now if we really wanted to probably do that so as you can see I've unlocked pretty much everything this season so we're just gonna unlock that last thing and um, yeah I think that's good so we got pretty much everything unlocked it's just a matter of um, getting to all the different things uh, we have some of these traps the traps aren't really that good um, for damage or anything like that we still need to get our brewery up and running that will be our next project after we get the market done and I want to uh, work on the basically moving the kitchen over to the brewery or not the brewery the um, over here and what we'll do is we'll basically start tearing down this particular building we'll need to get a temporary uh, place set up for the um, tables and dining and stuff like that I'm not sure where I'm gonna be putting that probably in here if we can fit it I don't know I might just knock down a lot of this and try to rebuild it um, completely like we're gonna need a lot of space for our dining room and everything like that and the only other concern that I have is the storage underneath so we're gonna need to figure out that as well which means we might need to start moving things a little bit around so it doesn't interfere with the kitchen itself. So a lot of this is directly underneath. So all these parts right here. So we're going to need to fix that up before we can uh, start working on the kitchen, I think. And uh, even if it is requires us to kind of build a little bit further down this way, then that will be good. But uh, we do need to get at least four things dug out. So... Just some things that I need to plan out before we can start moving on. But uh, yeah, we'll start working on that slowly. And look at all that.
Alright, so everyone's pretty happy with the uh, event that we just had for the um, restitution... No? I, I don't re <laughs> remember how to pronounce that. Uh, restitutionist. Yeah, restitutionist. Uh, lectern, so... I, I guess that's um, more similar to Christianity than... Um, what's the other one? Uh, um, oh, I can't remember. Uh, um, it's kind of, um, I don't know. It's, it, it's an older religion. It's, uh, can't, I'm, I'm going to butcher it, so I'm not going to go there. But, uh, basically the other, the church of, um, or the brotherhood, um, brethren, uh, oak brethren, which is based on a different religion can't remember which one but yeah i guess that's basically what it is we have um cleaned up our wine so I've, i'm storing it under here for now because we're going to need to make a couple shipments of this out to neighboring factions um we just simply have too much of it I wasn't realizing that we were producing that much, honestly. So, we have a full thing down here. And I think this is mostly fine-aged wine, which is great. But, um... We're gonna need... We're gonna need, uh, to sell some of that, I think. And, um... Get as much of that sold. And, uh, we're doing pretty good for... Uh, points with this one. We're at 97 now. Wouldn't mind getting it a little bit higher. And keeping it above like 95 or whatever. But we'll see if we can't get 100% for that. And how are we with M0? Might want to start trying to do some business with them as well. I'm not sure what their relationship is with the philosophers though. So let's quickly take a look at that. Under the... Of the Alchemac records factions. So the only hostile people that they're with is the um, progeny of the plague, which is pretty sure it's a bandit. Yeah, these guys. So they're permanently hostile with us, anyways. So it shouldn't matter too much if we go with them. Now, these guys are not great with those ones, the Church of the Third Coming.
All right, so we got quite a bit of the stuff already built. Uh, I did move m the... There was a um, market stall over closer to the door here. Now, I moved it over this direction because I didn't know if that would cause a problem with like people going in and out of the door. So I wanted to make sure that it was secure. So I moved it a little bit more over this way and put the table here instead. Uh, that should be good. And we have another table over here. Um, as far as everything else, I think everything is pretty much assigned where I want it to go. Um, there isn't really anything too much that I want to kind of play out uh, for the design and stuff. It's just a matter of getting all these things uh, built most mostly. And uh, we still have some parts over here that need to be done. I added bricks over here so they can easily get the um, brick stuff all built. And it's just a matter of wood and limestone, I think, which they should have all access to. That's dirt, uh, limestone. We have a little bit of limestone left. So we should be able to finish this project for sure with what, what limestone we do have. Um, these guys are still coming back, so they're going to come. I did purchase some more bricks, though I did discover after the fact that we actually have quite a few bricks uh, over here in storage already, so didn't really need them, but, um, you know, when we're building our wall and stuff like that, um, I'm not sure if we're going to be able to do it this winter because we already have quite a bit of projects that I need to get completed, but um, we have a good pattern of start what we want for the um the wall design and stuff like that and we've kind of built an idea of what the towers are going to look like over here so we do have a general idea of what it's going to look like it's just a matter of getting enough bricks and stuff to build the exterior wall which can take some time to do because it does require a lot of bricks just to get that one section a couple sections done so um yeah it's going to take a little bit of time to actually do that, but I do want to focus in on building more um, multi-purpose buildings like these for housing and stuff. Uh, I was thinking about moving the path from here over to here, maybe knocking down this house and building a small pathway going through between here. Uh, we could do like a kind of an awning type thing and we can use that as our main route to the uh, thing over here, which if that's the case, then what I'm gonna do is I'm going to uh, remove this. So we got uh, quite a bit of that mold done today. I'm pretty happy with the progress that they're doing. Uh, we still need a lot of stuff to do uh, for this uh, particular project. 
Uh, there's the Marlins up here. There's the whole door section over here. And some of these parts over here still need to be built as well, which uh, should be done next episode for sure. Um, don't think it will take too much longer for them to work on that. With that being said, though, we do need to do some stuff over in the kitchen area. Uh, so what I've been doing is I've been telling them to mine out these parts here. And I think we're going to be fine for the third one right here. Um, don't think it will be in the way, per se, for what we're going to be building. It's like directly, like if you look right on the surface there, it's right at this block. So it's just off of the the pathway. So if we give it one block padding, we should be fine for the cold storage. Uh, though all this needs to be filled in, uh, these these five spots here so I need to move the cold storage for the food over over to this side which will take some time to do um, I got them to start mining out that area so we can get these parts moved so that everything can basically be moved upwards and what I'm going to do is I'm going to see if I can't um, organize some of these shelves and stuff a little bit more there's a lot of mixed shelves and stuff um, I wouldn't mind having vegetables in a certain location and other things like that. I also want to reinforce the um, the dig sites a little bit more too. So like I want to put like stone bricks and stuff around them, uh, around the perimeter of the cold storage to give it a little bit more uh, cooling effect. But that's a long term plan. It's not a short term plan. And the next pr project will be the kitchen itself and the part up here now I'm not sure what I'm going to be doing for the actual material just yet uh, I haven't really decided if I want to go with stone bricks or not I might just keep it as wood but then again it is a kitchen so I might want the kitchen part at least stone bricks and then have the upper four probably wood so we'll see if we can't do something like we did with the uh, building over here or something similar but more decorated kind of like what we've been doing over here but anyhow if you are new to my community i have a discord server if you want to hang out with us there will be a community poll on there as well as the community tab on youtube so if you want to uh, vote on either one of those uh there will be notifications on the discord server though so uh definitely check that out if you are interested and outside of that if you're new to my channel don't forget to subscribe comment down below rate the video and i'll see you guys next time thanks for watching peace out